Here's something really special. 1972 International Harvester Lodestar short bus, the kind I rode on in grade school. Haha. -ha. This one's cool because it's got like the extended roof line. We're putting windows back in. You can stand up straight in there. It's pretty nice. 345 with a five speed. It does run. Of course, don't have no brakes, but I'd love to get this together soon. As you can see, overall, the bus is in relatively good shape, unlike many of the other vehicles with excessive dents. This, uh, this one's pretty clean. Now we will venture inside the bus. Still completely original. We haven't had an opportunity to do any work on the vehicle yet. Remind you old school days. The plan is to completely strip the vehicle from head to toe, put tinted windows along the side and the back, and turn it into a party bus. This is the rear of the International Harvester 1800 Lodestar Short Bus. As you can see in the back, it actually had rounded windows with a strip down the corner. This is International Harvester Lodestar from around, what, 72, 75? Four-door crew cab is pretty rare. It's got a 345 and a five-speed. Supposedly came from the railroad up in California, and uh, it runs, gets uh, seven miles to a gallon. International Harvester. This is a Lodestar from the early 60s. I got it because it had a, some parts. <laughs> and I actually I've fallen in love with it since then and I hope to do something with it or one similar. Notice how, how narrow the cab is on these and how wide the fenders. Um, this one has a, had a three on the tree and a 345.